Only because Ness got really good. If Ness didn't have good buttons, bro, he would be losing so many matchups. Yeah. But Greninja can capitalize the edge guards, though. Like, I got Hydro Palm. I got Shadow. Um, yeah, Shadow Shuriken. I got Water Shuriken. I'm Shadow Sneak. I'm bugging out right now. Anyway. But yeah, the point is, like, Jay Grant has to capitalize Ness being on top of him to keep him to abuse how floaty Ness is. Yeah, that's and a cool guarding. combo. <laughs> like, half charge Water Shuriken into dash up uh, forward there. Right. And then he got combos with it, too. Whether, like, the medium one and the full charge one lead into two different combos that Greninja can throw. The little one is just a poke here and there, of course. Or the edge guard. Like, what we're already seeing right now, he's making Tony uncomfortable, spamming PK fire. Not going to get it for free. And plus, water beast fire anyway. Not, not very effective getting out of that scenario. <laughs> Oh, oh, but the yo-yo doing neutral damage is going to take his first stock. going to call it oh. out. And nice tech from Tony right there. Good reaction. Oh, shuts him up right there with the water shuriken. But this is what Tony wants. He wants to abuse that damage and push his lead as far as he can. Oh, good parry. That's not really easy to do. Oh, the forward is going to take no. it either way. He could have all smashed or feared. Jab right? Okay. Oh! Nice timing on Tony right there. He fell out of it, though. Right, it wasn't the whole thing. Yo, my man is moving right here. Oh, alright, another. He did that to Cody on the last set they played. Starting to use down there a lot more on shield. Oh! Right, taking He's his fading sweet back time. more seeing that Tony's like reaching. I was just saying he's taking his sweet time right now. Looking like a oh my god, looking like a dead frog right that there with sick. that back throw. The up, up air drag down. But I do like down. I do like the way how he's placing his fares though. He's he's teasing that range where it looks like he's just gonna do a, a badly spaced one, but they're all actually precisely spaced. Can you not absorb water here again? Um Ness can actually. I think he can absorb the fully hit one, but the bit. No, actually, no, he can't. I'm 90% sure he cannot absorb Water Shuriken. I mean, I feel like if he could have, we would have seen it by now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, Ness, he's he's keeping Tony on his toes in a solid neutral. Ooh, oh my god, barely misspaces that forward smash. Oh, here we go. Off smash. Oh, but he went too far. And that's yeah. That was a really good shuriken right there. Oh, okay, yeah, not too much that he can do, but a nice, precisely fair is gonna put Tony on his last stock. I want to see like some up air drag down from from, from Big Run. Oh, ah, <laughs> trying to get that sour spot in there. He's been practicing that lately. There's a there's a difference between like Greninja's actual Nair and then like the sour spot in there. Good Me coverage by Tony to not let that platform land. Go on punish. No yo. I was just gonna mention no yeah. yo yo. Ooh. Alright. Another solid neutral. Yeah, he can't absorb it, because he would have been done that yeah. You know who plays after this side? Uh, like who's waiting and loses finals? I'm not sure. Oh. Huh. Either way. Oh. Okay, yeah, I'm bugging. Eli, Eli waiting for uh, losers finals. Ah. Oh, okay. the yo yo. My man was saving that the whole time. I feel like we're gonna stay on P2 the whole game. Yeah. If you like that. Yep. I don't think I don't think none of these players are like gonna be counter pick heavy. It's just gonna stick to. PS2 and just adapt from their gameplay from there. Three, two, one, okay. go! Ooh. Starting out with a PK fire and uh, oh, it's actually better there than you know where the <laughs> other end was. <laughs> like, Tony was very close to connecting that to himself. My man said, "I'm not no boy. I can't hit with that whole thing." <laughs> 
No, I'll take the hit politely over right, here. Right, I'll take the baby hit rather than the whole body. My man did the same thing in game one. Jake Run is saving that, I know for sure. Up air drags. Oh, good Nair. Extending the combo. Oh. Oh, that was a good movement right there from Jay. For a second, I thought he was going to do some reverse up air for a second. Oh, nice, precisely timed yo-yo from Tony. Calling out the regular ghetto. Uh oh The IDJ is coming out from Tony. Oh, no, not like this. So much damage built up already from one interaction. Tries to hurry up and ends it with a forward smash and the down smash. Yo, yo, Jake run going really high right here. No, nah, yet, again, yet again, a normal get up is not going to do it. He has to at least make sense to get up attack as soon as the yo yo comes in and clutch. Wow, what a conversion. Uh, not a conversion. What a down here. Jake on not even. Oh, okay. Let her rip forward smash is gonna do it. We're playing a little bit of Beyblade out here. Just let her rip. Oh, shit. No jump. Oh, my God. PK fire angles. PK thunder now? Oh, oh the there's nothing that Greninja can do. No. Oh, good shadow sneak. I don't know why Tony wasn't using yo yo like that, but we're gonna move on anyway. Alright, good mix up with the chops. I think he didn't use Yo-Yo there because then he could have Hydro Pump to uh, high. Yeah, but he could have just... No, because... Like, uh, yeah, actually, yeah. You got a good point. Doesn't want to get the high Hydro Pump. Oh! And Jake runs just dashing too far yet again. He's probably expecting people to DI it correctly, but sometimes the no DI is the best DI, man. Alright, that yeah. time he gets the correct dash. And that's how you honestly keep Greninja on his toes, is that even if you see the, the, the down tilts and dash attacks coming in for the up smash conversion, you want to mix up. No, actually, you want to just DI away all the time. Because if, if, if you DI in, you're giving Greninja a lot of an easier time to get that conversion. Even if you get hit with the DI away, it will just most likely be the sour spot one. Good near coverage, knowing that Jay wanted to go into the top plat. He finally get up attack after, <laughs> <laughs> after two of his stocks going down. And right now, Jaegrun trying to think of a solid way how to approach in this neutral. But Tony's just, Tony knows he can just do a nair out of shoot if Jaegrun misspaces his aerials. I feel like one more nair is going to do it. I feel like that was covering out early Ooh, shadow sneak. Ooh, the one, the one time he did get up attack, he got back thrown. That was crazy. Yeah, I think that, that PK Flash is actually covering like the immediate shadow sneak. Yeah. I think he also he also did like the Palo strat, like he dashed too close to the ledge and just turned yeah. around, knowing that Jake the only mix up that Jake can really do would be like that to call out the yo yo charge or just roll. But Jay doesn't really like to roll like that, so Tony being fully aware of that I could just end the game with a back throw. And already up by a 2-0. Tony's been making quick work of these uh, sets. Right. we go, getting into game three. Parried a double up tilt. I've never seen Ness use that button. What happened? <laughs> Correct, get up what? attack this time. What he tried to dash into under him after that uh, water shuriken. What I'm seeing so far is that Tony is just getting harder and harder to be as the set progresses right here. Like, what it looks like is that Jake Run is one of those players that, like, he wants to end the set as fast momentum-based as he can. But in the long run, as his opponent is just going to get better, then it's, he's going to have a harder time getting these kill conversions that Greninja wants. Oh, good DI mix up with the down throw. Oh! I want to see him Hydro Pump the PK Thunder more, like, 
you gotta get Ness in an uncomfortable angle horizontally and then just, you know, wet him up a bit away from the thunder. Ah, right, but good forward air. Not gonna do it quite yet. But another forward air. <laughs> His forward airs are coming in clutch this whole time. Ah, right, but we're gonna parry that one, bro. <laughs> I don't want to get hit. <laughs> yeah. all, yo, I hate, man, I hate having anyway. those scenarios, bro. Oh, yeah, both respecting each other to the point where it's like, yo, like, you got to hit my shield, but I got to hit your shield. You do something, but you do something. And we kind of saw that hesitation from Jay going on a plat right there. Oh, my God. Is this joiner up here? Another up here is going to do it. Another, I, oh no, we're gonna actually do the yeah, call he went out. for the PK flash. He was like, air dodge down, I dare. Well, I dare you to air dodge right in my face. And that that was, that moment right there was the, with the top player scenario. Like, I right, know, are you gonna air dodge? Because if you do, I'm gonna punish the scrub option. But I feel like later on, like, Oh my god, you know what? That my late brain, back there was nuts. <laughs> he my delayed brain mad started, it was like, nah, that job reset was wild. Finally, an upper out of shoot. Oh! Somehow, Tony barely getting out of that let's um, that that drag down scenario. Oh my! My man had a phantom hit after that. You know, it took me a, a long ass time to realize phantom hits like really exist. Like two years ago. And I was like, nah, that's only a melee thing. Nah, the, 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 the phantoms exist in this game. Whenever you see, like, the way I had to tell, like, you, they got a phantom hit is that you see, like, an orange spark. <laughs> oh, oh, yo, how? My man Ness's scrawny, scrawny little ass legs. He got no calves. My man was crazy. This is the benefit you have for having no calves. My man just, my man Ness got straight feet. That blade went in between. He got no neck and no, and no legs. That's a courtesy. All right, good conversion with the sour nares. Oh, right here, no! That was his time to edge guard. Yeah, I haven't seen quite as much hydro pump play as I thought I would. That's honest. what I'm saying. Like in this matchup, like Greninja is normally known to consistently edge guard Ness. Ah, yeah, there was nothing he could have done right there. His yeah. only option was like to go really high, but Tony knew he had enough time to, to let it let go, it go and, and then react from there. Let Very it go unfortunate for